Uh, like I said, man, to be there, to be in a lane, represent my country, myself, family, friends, my coach right here that's been behind me 100%, just across the finish line with a PB. Simple. Yeah? Yeah. So the Olympics has been a dream of yours for some time now? I mean, every young kid that wants to, wants to run track, I'm sure they want to see the rings one day, and that's what I've been looking for since I've been running, and this is my dream country right there. So I'm gonna make it happen. Now you're just a little outside of the, the qualifying time. Uh, what are you doing to ensure that you actually make those qualifying times and even do better? I mean, with me now, um, I'm, I find myself doing more endurance work with the 400 meter runners. Like sometimes my coach will be like, oh, you wanna jump in with the sprinters? I tell him no, because I need the longer stuff to get me stronger for the 200, obviously. Cause that's my better event, everyone's here. So with me, my change, my change in training is really improved. And I'm not really backing off from it. Like, whatever I have to do, I have to put it done, because this is an important year. Now you spent the Christmas with family and friends. What are some of the things you've been doing outside <laughs> of track? <laughs> uh, a lot of these parties, checking the girls. I have to check the girls, man. Um, a lot of quality time with the family, friends, and just really been chilling. Um, not too much, but just a lot of fun. So what's on your agenda when you first get back? Uh, back to school. <laughs> Back to school um, on, the, on the Friday, I go back the Thursday, and I'll start back training solid on the Monday and ease my way back in.